Hello YouTube, this is GZ from GZ Gaming. Um, I just tried to record a video, but then I realized there was no audio, so I'm gonna try this again. Um, yeah, well, I just went through the biggest horde that we have ever gone through, like, ever in the history of playing this game. It went from 10 p.m. to 10, no, sorry, 8 a.m. Um, it was crazy. Like, there was over 50 police zombies, there was like over 30 feral zombies. I, I lost count. This is just guesstimating, really. I have no idea how many there were. But it was just absolutely nuts. Um, so if I do upload my first video that I ever did, I've done a lot of renovations to our tower here. And it goes all the way to the bedrock now. I mean, I've still got a lot of mining to do, which I'm not going to do in this video because, well, the sound is absolutely horrendous. But um, just take a look at all these gore blocks. This is just a little taste of what I had to deal with the night before. Night 93. It was just crazy. This isn't even all of them. This isn't even a quarter of them. There is so many people, so many zombies coming after me, like, during the night, I was hiding away in the tower, like, picking them off, and then it continued on throughout the day, like, until 8 a.m. It was nuts, it was 10 hours of intense, nail-biting zombie fighting, like, it was just crazy, it was absolutely insane. I think, it, I went through almost 500 magnum bullets. I went through about 150 shotgun rounds and about 28 sniper rifle rounds, which was mostly used for the stupid hornets. But uh, yeah, and they actually destroyed a couple of the blocks. So I gotta fix that up sometime too. Um, but yeah, yeah, it was just nuts. That was the craziest horde I've ever been through. And. I am honestly a little scared of what's going to come on day 100 because apparently it just keeps getting bigger and bigger and bigger. Like, I, there hasn't been a time where it hasn't gotten bigger. I mean, it skipped a day. It skipped a couple of hordes, actually, which was kind of strange. But it just, it keeps getting bigger. Um, what I was showing before, and I'll show it again. I was, well, I gotta find where I put him now. I, I was looting as many of the police zombies and feral zombies as I could. And, and, yeah, I think that's them there. Yeah. And these are the weapons I got. And basically, all I was doing is, well, let's just load one up just for an example here. So, anytime you pick up a weapon, oh, it's raining. Anytime you pick up a weapon, uh, if you put it in here, let me show you this here. So, that's 467 bullets. If you put it in this little box here, it takes the bullets out for you. So, it's a good way to get some extra ammunition if you, you know, want to save a couple resources, especially these bullets, you know, since it takes three gunpowder to make. But, um, so, yeah. Yeah, that, that's about it. I did that for all these guns here. I'll check them eventually. I'm not going to do that and bore you all with that. So, but what I do need to do is make some bullet tips. I am out. And I have no idea where I put the lead. Uh, maybe it's here. I don't know. I just reorganized this entire base. It was starting to bug me a little bit. So, I don't know. I guess... Oops. 150 of those will do. That should be enough to keep me going for a while. And if you're curious as to where I got all these resources, well, one, it's day 94, and I play a lot, as you might be able to tell. And I also have this guy, which took me like 80 days to find. So if you don't have one yet, don't worry about it, honestly. I mean, these tools are extremely slow and really painful. Like, I would not suggest making a base like this. Um, 
unless you have the auger. And even then, it's still painful. Like, it's just terrible. The amount of time that it takes to mine all of this, and the amount of resources it took to build this, it was, like I said, for the horde, it was crazy. It's, I spent about 30 days getting halfway, like, not even halfway, it was about a quarter down with just a pickaxe. Like, I almost got so bored that I left the game, like, but I, I tread, trudged on, continued with my work. And it really helps for most of the zombies, but even at that depth there, like how low that is, it doesn't kill the feral zombies or the cop zombies, so like, it almost seems pointless. I'm gonna have to go out, put a bunch of spike traps, hopefully hurt them enough so that when they do fall, they die. I was thinking about putting some spikes, like maybe three up, so I could loot the bodies there, but then, you know, the gore blocks would pile up and eventually I wouldn't be able to loot any of them. So... I don't know. I, I don't know what I'm going to do, but enough of me babbling. I got to make some bullet tips here. Uh, I don't remember where I put anything. I wish they had a more dynamic crate system. Like, they've only got six or so. Uh, there it is. I mean, it, it's really helpful. I was only using these secure storage chests for a while there. And it got so cluttered that, you know... I eventually had to do something. Oh my goodness. That is going to be way too many bullet tips. But, whatever. Uh, where is my wood? There it is. I'm going to have to get some wood soon. So. This is going to be a lot of logs. <laughs> and this is probably why I get such big hordes. <laughs> oh well. I, we need the resources, eventually, at some point or another, so, I don't mind, pretty easy to pick off the spider zombies now, well, sometimes they yell, but they don't really call the cop zombies and, or the feral zombies, so that's always good, you know, I just sit up top, watch them fall, laugh at them a couple times, and then it's all good, I go back to doing what I'm doing, but, um, so, yeah, well, I don't really need these right now. I'll just put them away. Uh, I don't remember where I put all my extra bullets. Maybe... Oh, yeah, it was this one. Oh, I don't have any more. Seats uh, must have taken them. So, these ones are all the ones I have checked. I, I just threw all the other ones in some random chest for now. I guess I should eat. Uh, I'm gonna get some bear. Apparently... Bear stew is the best thing to raise wellness, which I am desperately in need of, because, like, I keep dying. Even the last horde, I died once, you know. I wasn't paying attention. I went down to the bottom of the ladder and accidentally shot my ladder out, and, and that was that. I couldn't get out of it. <laughs> Two cops cornered me, and I was done. But, oh well, you live and learn. Well, or you die and learn. Either one. Whatever works for you. But, uh... As long as you have a nice place to hide away from when things get nasty, then hopefully everything should be alright. Oh yeah, I'm just going to make some bullets since I've pretty much exhausted our supply of magnum bullets. Like, I'm surprised we even have any left. That was just so many zombies, that was just nuts. I couldn't believe it. I have never seen that many zombies before. Oh, that's what I was going to do, derp. Well, okay. I was going to split up the the bullets, but yeah, I probably should. Why not? I'm going to make some more molds. Yeah. Again, I don't really know where anything is. <laughs> I forgot. Oh, well. That is the problem when you have too much stuff. There it is. Gotta make some more of this. Uh, I think it goes something like this. You know, I might as well just make a bunch of this. I don't really need 75 of them, but... It's always good to have stock, just in case I'm doing something else at the crafting table. So... I think 30 should do. Alrighty. Now... I don't remember how to do it. Um, ah, 
I need bullet casings. Forgot about that. Well, wait, no. I'm not making that mold. I need bullet tips. Yeah, there we go. Got one of those. Whoops. Apparently, I don't know what buttons I'm pressing. Oh, I need to make one more of those. Ah. There we go. That should do. Put that in there. I'm probably going to get a lot of spider zombies. Sometimes I get nine at a time. It's freaking ridiculous. But so is my crafting, so I understand. Ah, grab another 50. Yeah, I don't really know any other way to do that, so let's reset this to <laughs> not use as many logs. That would be bad. Waste a hundred logs in a furnace for nothing. And I think that should be a oh shoot. Almost wasted one. Alright, should be enough bullets tips to get me started. There we go, perfect. Now, we need some magnum bullets. I've been making lots of these, so I just remember it. As you can tell, it's actually one of my favorite guns to use in this game. Oops, I forgot something. Doop -a -doop. That's always a growing trend with me. Looks like we're going to need bullet casing soon. Oh, really? Oh, well. Wasn't that difficult. Come on. So. Yeah, I, I find this game rather enjoyable, though. I mean, I've actually gotten the max level now. So I, I don't really know what else to do other than build the base up and get scared of the hordes. So. I'm going to start needing seats so soon. Well, she's been helping out for quite a bit, and it actually helps a lot, because then I can actually loot the cop zombies and the feral zombies that fall down below once I kill them. But, um, I'm really going to need her help soon. This is starting to get intense. Like, it's just nuts out there. Alright. Oh, I know what I should do. So, one of the things I need to do is start building up the bottom of the base. Because, uh, yeah, they are crazy. I don't really know where I'm putting my cement mix. I keep forgetting. Yeah, sure, this will do for now. I guess I should, whoops. I guess I should put these back where they belong. Uh, somewhere in here. There it is. Get that out of the way. I don't remember where this goes. Um, you know what? You can just go here. Whatever. Like I said, I'll organize it later. I don't really want to bore everybody here with that. Organizing is never fun to watch. Let alone do. But, um, I need to find my iron ore. Where did I put that? There it is. I think I have enough rebar frames and bars. I think I'm just going to make a whole bunch of steel. 200 is probably a bit much though. I'm going to need to save some. It's not like we're made out of iron here. Uh, I keep forgetting what I'm doing. Bear with me here. Uh, there it is. Alright, so, 200 should probably do, 1200, that divides by 6, perfect, now I need 160 minutes of logs, don't remember how much that would be, so, yay, wellness is actually increasing, it was up to 164, and now I'm down to 128, so I really need to start making bears to get that stuff up, because it's actually really helpful to have high health, you don't die from one hit, from most things, and you can actually survive a couple of hits, but uh, not quite as many as I would like to do. Now, where did I put those logs again? I keep forgetting. That'll do.
Ah, oh, that's gonna be a lot of logs. Oh my goodness. We're gonna have to cut down the entire national forest over there. Soon I will have some iron. Or no, sorry, not iron. Steel. That's what I'm getting. I really gotta organize this base better. I thought I organized it well, but there's too many of these crates now. Don't know where anything is. And I keep having to switch floors. That's always annoying. Organizing a little easier. I'll just put that there. That way they all go there and I don't have to worry about it. Okay. So, yeah. You seen how much of a pain that was to organize, like, just a couple things. Imagine if I did all of the stuff I looted. That would not be fun. Especially not the watch. So. Well. That's going to take a while. So, I don't really know what I'm going to do for you right now. I'm not going to go mine stone with the auger because, well, that's just annoying. And it's really, really loud. And I'm sure you don't want to listen to that. I even turn down the volume when I'm mining with that thing. Oh. I think I heard some spider zombies. Yeah, I hear him walking. There he is. Oh. I really, really hope he didn't call anybody. I don't feel like dealing with that right now. Let me just double check. Ah, it looks like I'm good. So yeah, quite a bit of base construction to do. It's already almost nighttime. Holy. Ugh, I hate these stairs, but Sita likes them. So I at least put one ladder. Had to leave one set of stairs for her though. But uh, maybe one day that can change. Oh, I know what I should do. I need to fix that side of the ramp before nighttime comes. So, let's go like this. Grab some of these and that. And we should be good. Oops. That wouldn't have been good. Drop down and sprain my leg. So I've already <clears throat> I've already upgraded some of these, but it takes a lot of resources. Uh, I need some stone. Yeah, I'm not going to try this side. It takes a lot of steel to start upgrading that stuff. Like, you really want to make sure you put it in the right place. Because it's five steel bars per block. So that there was like 175 at least. It's nuts, man. Yeah. I wish I had more iron. I know a 200 looks like a lot, but it goes by fast. It, it's like, it doesn't last very long at all. Uh, I gotta make things easier to access. This is a pain in the butt. Oops. Guess I should get out on the right floor. It might help a little bit. Boop, 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 boop. Looks like it was just that one side there. I think I should make this a little wider so they don't get to the outside so fast. But, oh man, I forgot some wood. I was looking right at it too. I always do that. Grab everything except two things. And then I grab one thing and forget the other thing. But, oh well. It is what it is. A little bit of time wasted, but that's okay. 
made it this far, so I'm sure we'll be just fine. Let's see if I can just upgrade this like this. Yes. There we go. Last time I wasn't able to do that, which kind of saddened me a little bit. That wasn't fun. I had to destroy the rebar frame to put in a rebar frame. That didn't seem to make any sense at all to me, but it is what it is, I guess. So... Man, I don't know if this design works out very well. I can see down there better, but I don't know. It's, it's, it's tough to say. I can't really tell if it helps or not. Oh, no, no, this is going to suck. Oof, I am so lucky. <laughs> I can't believe that. I did not run when I tried to jump. And as you can tell, that would have been a very painful death. Now, I would have lost these wood planks here because last time I fell I went to this wall and back to this wall and then down and the game decided I didn't need my backpack so I lost like 300 magnum rounds for whatever reason I didn't have it in my toolbar here this game is set up to drop just your backpack and of course that also drops all your clothes so now I have all these crappy clothes well crappy to me everything was purple because the game decided I no longer needed a backpack. So, oh well. It's not like the... It's not like the armor in this game really helps too much, honestly. I mean, I think it saves you one blow from a zombie, and that's about it. Not much else. Apparently, I was doing some reading, and like, the gloves were the ones that give you the most protection. Were the only ones that give you the protection. But I don't know what version that was. I'm in Alpha 12.5, which you can see, but... Um, so I don't know if it actually helps any. But, uh, I don't know. I like to think that it does. So, I want to repair this because mining helmets are incredibly useful in this game. Uh, gonna have to make some more steel strips soon. Uh, I should probably get on that now. If I can find my metal bars, I don't really want to use those ones. Uh, they're probably all downstairs. I like to throw things in stupid spots. I guess it's helpful because I will be needing rebar down here, but... Uh, I almost jumped, I forgot there's no hay down here anymore. That's another thing, if you didn't know, hay will stop your fall damage, so if you put hay at the bottom of this like a ladder or something, you can just fall all the way down. So long as you don't hit some floors on the way, you'll be perfectly fine. Alright. Wow. I cannot find... Huh, that sucks. Apparently I've lost my steel pipes. Oh, I guess I should wear this if I want to actually use the flashlight. There we go. And that's why the mining helmet is so good. Oh, I forgot about that. Alrighty. I don't really know where I put my steel bars. They're not steel bars. You know, you know what I'm talking about. Steel pipes. That's it. Let's see if I can find some hay. Uh, I didn't bring any down here. I don't know why. Usually I do. I guess I'll bring these up. Show you guys getting some extra ammo. So. I find the police zombies to be much better to loot than the feral zombies because they drop full weapons like almost 80% of the time. So yeah, I just put it in there and it gives me these bullets here. These are all pretty crappy parts so I'm just going to scrap that. Put this in there, get an extra 8 shotgun shells. Those ones are pretty easy, I'm not too worried about those. But, well, neither than 9mm bullets but... The ones I really like are the hunting rifles, or um, sniper rifles, SMG bullets. Those are always good to get extras of. Ah, I keep checking this chest, and I don't know why. I just really want to do it. It's like something's telling me to make some fuel. But I, I got enough for now. So. Where are the guns I didn't check? There they are. Alright, let's see if I can find these steel pipes, and then, uh, yeah, maybe I'll do something interesting, I don't know. Uh, 
Alright, put these away while I'm at it. Uh, while I'm looking for them, I can start making some gravel. Uh, that's gonna take me some time, apparently. Oh uh, yeah, that's where cement goes. Let's see if I can find where I put the cement. <laughs> I know I wasn't gonna do any organizing, but like... Ah oh, man, everything has a spot, and it has to go in that spot. Otherwise, I can't find it. Like, right now is a prime example of me not being able to find my crap. So, yeah, that's all food. That's good. I wouldn't have put it in there. I don't know why I'm checking that. What's this? Nope, not in there. Alright, maybe it's one more up. Wow. Really, I had like a thousand steel pipes. I don't know where any of it went. And partly the reason why I have so much junk is I really don't like to waste anything. I pretty much pick up everything. And ah, there's some zombies. Ah, oh, really? Oh no. Oh, Lord. I'm glad I put this window here. Ah, this is probably called a horde by now. Whoopsies, I gotta stop doing that. I don't see him. There should be one more. They usually come in packs of three. Uh, oh, he didn't see me. Oh, there he is. Wow. Oh, he's gonna run around like around my pillar so I can't shoot him and call all his buddies. And now I'm gonna have to waste another 500 bullets. But it looks like I got lucky. Let me just test the waters. I don't know why I loot these guys anymore. They don't really carry anything that good. Oh, that one decided to disappear on me. Same with that one. Oh, that's why. They went up there. I thought I heard something. I don't know what it was, but I thought I heard something. Yeah, no, it looks like this is all repaired. All good to go. Okay. And there's no chests up here. Where would I put those steel pipes? I really don't know. I, unless I died with them, which would not be cool. That would really, really suck. Because I need those. It's like, I don't have a whole lot of iron. Well, according to me, anyways. Maybe it's some other people, but... Maybe not to some other people. I need like thousands of iron. This base, this base never ends. The, the amount of construction that goes into it is just ridiculous. Okay, well, I, I don't really know. It looks like I'm just gonna have to make some more. Yay me. I really hope I didn't die with all thousands of them. That's another problem with having too many chests. You don't know where anything is. Uh, I don't see it. I don't see a tang. See if seats are stolen. Nope. Hey, what the heck? I have no idea. I don't know where it went, man. I don't know. Who knows? Kinda weird me out. Like seriously, I had hundreds and hundreds of them. If I ever find them, you'll see. Let's see. I had two stacks of 500 at least, and I think another stack of two. Uh, I'm so sorry for organizing in this episode. <laughs> That's not what I meant to do. But uh, it's gotta be done sometimes. Now, where did this concrete go? I think it was. This one here, perfect. I can go there. I can go there. I can stop making that. I don't feel like losing all of those too. I can go over there. I'm gonna have to start making some iron bars. I don't got a choice. That sucks. I'm gonna call hundreds more of these spider zombies. Which 
I don't know, that's fun, but it gets annoying, you know? 498. Um, I need to check to see if that divides by 3. I don't think it does. So, when I'm smelting iron ore like this, <clears throat> I look at the amount. It says 498, right? So, 498 divided by 3 is 166. Wow, perfect. As long as it comes out to an even number, you're fine. But if it's like 165.2, then just go... 165 times 3, and whatever number that is, is the amount that you want to put here. And then you'll get a perfect quantity of steel or iron bars. Well, iron in this case is 3, and steel is 6. So, man, that takes forever. 144 real-time minutes. I ain't got time for that. Oh, there was some logs. Perfect. I'm gonna have to go chop hundreds of trees pretty soon. That must be like 22. Yeah, 22. Alrighty. So yeah, back to finding steel bars. <laughs> steel pipes. I mean, geez, I can't even say the names of things correctly. I'm just gonna double check. No. 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 Oops. No. Nope. 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 I really gotta stop moving things around. I don't even know what was in this one here. Ah, uh, man. Nope. 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 And nope. Nada. What's in here? Oh yeah, all the random junk. Oh, that's a full stack, isn't it? Ah, well, that can go there. And... That can go there. Alright, perfect. So anyway, I can just go like this with most of the junk that I usually get that I never really need right away. Like, ever. Oh, I thought there was a zombie for a sec, but it was just the darkness. Nope. Nope. I really, really hate looking for things on this base. I gotta fix it up. I gotta. But again, I'm not gonna run the auger while recording. That's just overkill. I mean, that that's just horrible. Once you get the auger, you'll know what I'm talking about. You start hearing that sound, it's just terrible. It's so loud. It sounds like those old western style movies with the little chain minigun where Buddy's using a hand crank. And yes, I hear spider zombies, but I don't got time for that. Okay, so I think I found them. There they are. Look, I have 1,500 steel pipes. Or short iron pipes, whatever you want to call them. But yeah, I'm going to go take care of those spider zombies. At least I know where it is. It's in the floor before I mine to the bedrock. See, this is what I'm talking about. Once you start forging this large amount of materials, these guys never stop showing up. They, like, they harass you every single hour. Like, I think I said before, I had nine of them at one time. Nine of these dudes just showed up, like, hey, what's going on? Come here and check your base. I don't get it, man. I don't get it. Well, I do. I know. It's my forge. I know. When you're making thousands and thousands of items, that's just what happens. I keep hearing him, and I imagine he's going to call his little buddies, and I'm going to have... Oh, there he is. There we go. Now let's just pray that nobody else comes to stay. Yeah, it looks like it's okay. Hmm. Man, these guys are really annoying. Like I said, I don't really know why I loot these guys. Every time I get near him, he just disappears on me. That little bugger. Well. And these little holes that Buddy was hiding in here that I don't can't seem to get out of now. There we go. These stupid little holes that they dig into the side of our mountain is the reason why... 
I have made this part here. I'm probably going to make it a little bit wider or a little bit bigger, you know, because it's actually not that far out of mine from here to the wall. So, I'm not sure. I don't, I don't, I don't quite know how I want to do this yet. But, uh, yeah, yeah, that's that. So, I am going to steal some of these. Yeah, no pun intended. Grab this. Apparently the repair tool is the only one I can use steel when you're upgrading concrete walls. Now I'm gonna oopsies. I'm gonna put away these resources because these are meant for up here. I'm tired of going back and forth, up and down, trying to find supplies, because I don't remember where I put them. Seriously? Okay, it's just a wandering horde. We're good. Sorry, I had to listen there. Make sure it's not those stupid spider zombies again. Those guys get annoying. That's how it happens sometimes. You shoot three of them and like three more right there. I show them right up, right after the other ones. Doesn't matter how many times you kill them. They keep popping up. Oh well, that's the nature of the beast. I don't remember where I put paper, so I need to, ugh, I really need to organize this place. This is horrible. This is just terrible. You know what? You dumb chest. Goodbye. Goodbye. Get out of here. You too. I actually know I need those downstairs. And I don't really want to lose this. I mean, it's not that big of a deal to make, but I just don't want to make it again. Sheru. The last level before the mine. And I can tell because it's the deepest section. I was going in sixes, or no, actually eights, sorry, I guess it would be, because it would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and the top layer is eight. That's how I was doing my floors, and it looks like I need to repair this. I much prefer the nail gun. Whoa, 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 whoa. No. Bad. Bad repair tool. Okay. So, if you happen to be carrying steel and you don't want that to be happening, you can also repair things with this concrete bucket. Um, I don't know if that was intended. Yeah, see, you heard the sound there. Probably not, because I was talking. But, let me see if I can find a broken one. Yeah, I, I don't think that was intended, but uh, you can repair things with a concrete bucket. That's just how it is. Okay, so this one is a little bit cracked. <laughs> I just think that's hilarious. I don't know why. Uh, that's just too funny. Okay, so... Grab... Oh, really? I forgot all my bars up top, but... Oh, well. Grab that. I don't really need anything up there at the moment. Go like that. This is all the junk that has to go upstairs. And that can be scrapped. Yeah. That's pretty bad. That's just terrible. Alrighty. So I really need to make some walls here. Because I thought this would be a big enough drop for the cop zombies and feral zombies. But no, no, they still live. So I gotta have a plan B here. This ain't really gonna work. For some reason I didn't see those right away. So I guess what I'm going to do is, since this is a main support beam going all the way up, you can barely see it up there, these are the ones I'm going to upgrade first. Since those guys just don't want to die. So, yeah, yeah, those are the ones I'm going to upgrade first. Because I don't really want them to collapse this giant tower here. I've got 95 days worth of junk that I've collected going on here. Yeah, it's pretty nuts. Pretty, pretty nuts. I 
I thought I heard somebody banging away. Where the heck are you? How can I hear you from way down here? I don't know. Sorry, I was probably talking away from the mic there. Might have been doing that a couple of times, but that's okay. So... Since this is the last layer, uh, I just went ahead and filled everything in with concrete. Why not? The more distance I can keep the zombies from us, us being me and Sita, of course, the better. Cause that last horde was just nuts, man. It was intense. In fact, I think I'm gonna double layer this wall here. And then make like a little a little perch on the fourth block or so, so that way if the gore blocks get up, they won't reach me right away. That's a problem I've noticed before. Is if you only have like two or three blocks between you and your pit, the the gore blocks build up really fast and things start getting into your base pretty fast. So especially if they don't die from this drop. Can't believe that. Looks like they've already nerfed for fall damage. Which, uh, honestly doesn't make sense to me because if anything were gonna fall from a hundred meters, I'm pretty sure it would not be able to use its legs anymore. It would be just like those crawlers that you see all over the place. I would go deal with whatever's attacking my stuff up top, but uh, I really, really gotta prepare for day 100 horde. I was looking on YouTube at some other videos, and this guy, well I don't know if it was a guy, but this, this one video was like, the infinity horde on day 100, I'm like, oh no, that's my next one. Like, I really, really don't know if I'm ready for that, even with hundreds and hundreds of bullets, I don't know. But, uh, I think it's been, been quite some time now, so I'm going to go up and check, see how things are doing, and, yeah, after this I'm going to start blasting away on the auger, which, uh, I'll spare you guys that. Yeah, I knew it, those stupid spider zombies. There we go. See, they just come non-stop. They just don't stop coming. They really, really don't want to leave me alone. But I really don't want to stop forging either, so I can, you know, I get it. I get it. You guys like the heat. It must be cold out here or something, you know. You gotta eat, right? Everybody's gotta eat. And good, they didn't call a massive horde of nobodies. Alright. Oh, what was that? Oh. Just one of those guys. Which everybody should be one of those guys if they're falling that far down. Like, really. Alright, it's been good recording for you guys and everybody on YouTube and I hope you all have a great day. I hope you enjoyed watching. Uh, I know I didn't really do much, um, but yeah, you know, I hope you enjoy. I just wanted to share my game experiences and, and all the fun times and fun games that you can play. And I find I really enjoy this game. Um, so yeah, I shall see you all later. Have a great day. Bye.